Are you mad at me now? Oh no. I'm sorry. What? How do I get you to be back? Hello? Hello? Hello, everybody. Welcome back. This is Tinker77, and we're back on the Q-Tech world, and I'm in a little bit of a mountainous zone. And we are here for a specific reason. And that was because in the last episode, you know, I moved some villagers, and we found out the villagers needed either rotten flesh, a lot of it, or emeralds. And so I decided to go and look for this mountainous area and where we could use the digital miner, which I've set up and already have run through and processed to uh, get some emeralds. So to look at a map here, if you can see where I'm here on this map, it's not that far from the base. Actually, what I did was I went out from our the base right here and I saw this area and I kind of headed through the river and I went along the coastline here and there's a couple ships. I didn't really investigate the ships because I really wanted to find this mountains and I found this mountainous area right here. So I set up the digital miner and uh, yeah, we got some stuff. Now, I used some diamond chests here and I was afraid when you put the diamond chests together, it actually made like two bits uh, screen space. So I, I had to change the, uh, the screen size. But if you look here, uh, this is what we got from that. Now I did take the coal and tried to uh, make it into coal blocks. Same thing with the redstone blocks and same thing with the lapis. But the thing we are really uh, concerned about right now is the emeralds. And we got almost three full stacks of emeralds. I'm going to take that with us right now. We're going to take the diamonds and I think we're going to take the redstone. That's also critical for us. Most of this other stuff, probably the uranite would be good because we use that for power. But the rest of this, I'm not so concerned about. So I'm going to take uh, the digital miner. Don't want to forget that. I'm going to leave this stuff here. We know where that is, and if we ever need some more resources, and maybe during a stream, we'll come over here and grab it and that sort of thing. So let's go on home, okay? We are going to today to try to get the ender pearls. Uh, somebody just, like, appeared. Are you out here, dude? You're always in... Oh, no, these guys are okay. They, they don't drink potions, do they? Oh, they got turned into the cleric because of the bruise stand in front of them. Hi. Hi. Okay, let's go put this stuff away, and we'll keep the emeralds on us because we're going to be using that immediately. So let's uh, put all of this here away. We don't need much of this at all. And I'm going to turn the interface back to uh, what I like because it's just too big. I have it set to auto, and to me, that's a lot easier to read and to see. Okay, so here we go. We are talking to these guys down here, and if you recall, I don't want to have the uh, sword on is that they either take emeralds to get redstone, which is cool, or it takes, this guy takes rotten flesh to get emeralds, which we don't have, so we went and got some emeralds. And this is the same way. So let's see what happens. We're trying to get to ender pearls. So if I put some stuff here and like that, that should do it. He's like, yes. Okay, we got some trades. And you can see he's probably getting refreshed here. And now we have gold will give us emeralds. And now we can get emeralds. So let's go get some gold. That's fantastic because we know we can get gold through our uh, various resources here. We got over a thousand gold, so feels like I'm trading with the piglins, doesn't it? But no, we're trading with these villagers. We're trying to see if we can get them to have a trade that has emeralds or not emeralds, ender pearls. So here we go. Give me some of those emeralds back. You're an apprentice. Is that enough? There you go. Okay. He's showing you all the trades they got. That's cool. And now we can get, for one rabbit's foot, we can get an emerald, which I don't really care about. And we can get for four emeralds, we can get, for three, I should say, we can get some glowstone. We have to get some more trays and get them to the next level. So let's buy some more redstone. And that's going to take forever with the amount of redstones that we have. I'm trying to get to trick his trade out. What if we buy some uh, lapis? Is that a higher level? Yes. Okay. There we go. And you can see that gets the level bar all the way up to the next level. So you should change out. And maybe we'll get some more trades. We're looking for ender pearls. And there it is. There it is, guys. We can get ender pearls for four emeralds. That's good. Um, that's a good price. Let's see if this guy, maybe this guy has a better price. So let's just work on him for a little bit. Get him to the next level. There we go. But now we have a way of getting emeralds. We have a way of getting ender pearls. And we're doing this because we want to get enderium which is a resource that we need. Okay, let's get some uh, four emeralds back. Thank you. 
We'll just clear him out. He's like, uh huh. That's right. Villager tree. What is this? Purification powder purifies blocks into surface world versions. I don't even know what that is, but it's only worth one emerald. I mean, heck. Well, okay, so we click on that. Who knows? But we'll get a stack. How's that sound? I like that idea. Okay, do you have ender pearls? And you do, and it's the same price. It is four. We have two vendors now who have that, so let's get some ender pearls, I think. I think it's time to do it. So... There we go. We got 12 there. And we're going to get some more here. And this way we can at least have some of these and we can try to figure out how we're going to make endearing. So we got ender pearls. This was fairly easy. As long as you can use a digital miner, guys, use a digital miner, you get the emeralds, you can get the system. Okay. You get, and villagers, of course. Ooh. I just tried to ender pearl down there and I hit him. I'm sorry. Don't hold on to the ender pearls. <laughs> That's a really bad dirt. Okay. <laughs> Are you mad at me now? Oh, no. I'm sorry. What? How do I get you to be back? Hello? Hello? Oh. I really messed up. Let's go to go to sleep here. It's getting dark. Um, hopefully, they'll be good again. Anyway, uh, while we sleep, I'm going to drink some hot coffee. Hmm. It's really hot too. It's really fresh. Do they ever like lose their remembering of their that they're angry at me? Maybe in a day or two. I don't know. And this may be all we need. I mean, we got that. I I feel bad. Okay, so we are trying to make stuff for solar panels. Let's go take a look at this really quick. So this solar these cores are the trickiest part. I think we're working on is it this one? Yes, this one takes enderium, and also we need ender cores. But the enderium, we have to make this, and this is using four of those ender pearls. See, we're going to make a lot more. We're going to need more ender pearls because we got to make this right here is for this solar panel. It takes eight of those per one of these, right? And so each of these takes uh, eight of these. So that means we need sixty-four of these. So we're going to need. At least, well, all of this, what is that, 64 we said we need? Yeah, we're going to need a lot more ender pearls. I hope they, they, they come back. I don't want to have to go get another guy over here and do all of that. Are you going to be nice? Can, can you be nice to me? How, how do you, uh, oh, good. Oh, oh. And he has, like, bottles of enchanting. Now, what about you? Are you going to be nice to me, too? Cause like, I'm sorry I hit you. I don't know. I can't really get to him enough to trade, I don't think. Okay, well, e e enough of this. Let's let's figure this out. Let's figure out how to make uh, the Enderium. So we're going to put all this back. And we're trying to make, on this one right here, Enderium ingots. Okay? So let me bookmark this. It's, it is basically... Well, enderium dust, which we get from those crushing this stuff. So that's not going to help us. Alloy smelting is the way to go. We'll add that to there. And it's just lead and it's platinum and it's ender pearls. So we need to have another one of these machines set up. This one right here is, what is this doing? I think this is doing glass. Yeah, it's doing glass. Um, you know, we could use this now that I have 60, the glasses like already created. I can take these out. Since this is a smelting fa No, I need this one. Never mind. I need to make another one of these. Do I have an alloy smelter spare? I do. Okay, so we're going to need one of these. So let's get this started. We're going to make another one of these out here. We need the universal cables. This is our power system cable. And we're going to put this thing down there. There we go. We need an importer to bring in the stuff. So let's do that. Importer. We'll make one. There it is. Don't need those anymore. We're going to need an uh, external storage, right? For the top part. We are going to need an uh, more cable, which we have. We're going to need a crafter, which we have. 
we're going to need a, a one of those interfaces. This one right here, which we need an exporter for. Grab it. Nope, need another one of these machine printers. I thought I built a bunch of these, but I guess I didn't. And there we go. Machine casing and the interface. And it looks like I lost my importer to the uh, build of that. So let's make another importer. Okay. And we need a crafting uh, upgrade. And there we have that. Okay, so that's all done. So let's get the actual system set up. This is the importer. And then we have to do the crafter, which we have on us. And we have an interface, which is that. And I know we have a wrench that we use. That's what I, how I use to turn it. Okay, there it is. Don't need that anymore. Interface, we put the crafting upgrade. We've done this a bunch. Put this over here. Set it to extract, and I always put a cable. I like that. I You don't have to have all that, but I like having it. Okay, so we've got that done. We are doing good here. We are at 11 minutes on the recording, so I've got lots of time. Let me take another drink. Mm. Delicious. Okay. So now we have to get the uh, pattern set up for it, so let's do that. We need to get, uh, it was in Derium, and we're going to try to do that one right there. Yes, I wanted to catch it before they switched over to dust. Lead, platinum, and ender pearls. And we need a pattern. We'll just re-encode over this one. And there it is. Okay. And we will put that into here. So good. So now when we go to over Enderium, we can say craft. And we can say start. Start. And the machine should start working. And it will craft up what we need. And then we can put it into here and we can tell to automatically craft us and have us enough of the material there's see there it goes into the system that's awesome now let's go grab that we use that as an example for the interface and we said we want to have that and i want to have 64 of that now obviously it will not be able to make it it's going to try but it won't be able to make it because we don't have enough ender pearls so that's uh that works out so let's see about trying to get some more ender pearls Let's see about, uh, let's grab some gold. And let's see if we can get that up to 64. That would be great if we could get that to 64 um, of the Enderium. Uh, we need emeralds. We don't have a lot. We should try to be trading with these guys a lot to get emeralds as much as we can. Let's see, are you happy with me again? You don't look like you're happy with me again. I'm sorry, buddy. But you're okay. Uh, two, two of these will give me some emeralds. That cleared out that trade. But we want to get Ender Pearls, so. There we go. Look at all that experience. We could get that experience if we were down there, but I really don't have a problem with experience. This dude, though, can we go down there? I want to see if I can get closer to him and, and see if. Oh, he can trade with me. He just got pushed back. Okay. Now, I don't know if I got to make sure these guys are safer, I think, but let's get some more emeralds. And what else we get emeralds from? Rabbit's feet. Does he have some other weird trays for this? Rabbit's feet again. And scoots. Shoots? Scoots? Yes, those things. Uh, five emeralds for, for ender pearls. Four emeralds for ender pearls. Let's get some more of those. Awesome. Okay. And let's get back out of here real quick. And this should work. If we put this stuff in here. That should help out. The system should. It can't have 64. And I think that this is where it gets stuck. It's trying to process to make something. And it doesn't know what it's doing. So it should be working on making that. Why is it not? That's the pattern. 64 of those. It should say it's not doing it. Again, I am not a fan of refined storage anymore. I used to be a proponent of it. Now I'm not because this thing should be going like crazy. If we take out the Enderium, let's just take it out and see if it decides to like actually make something. And it's not. I mean, I don't understand why. So if I go over here and I say craft, oh, craft, start, start. It's like, oh, okay, I'll do it.
this should be working fine. So I don't know why it doesn't figure out that it needs to do it. But at least it's it, we have an easy way of making it. But it's not working. That just bugs me. I don't know why it would do that. Because if we go over here, it should be saying it needs to do it. But it's not. So, uh... Wow. Okay. Now, is there a way in here? I don't know if anybody knows this. Uh, and if you do, let me know. Um, but inside of the crafting grid, like this is a crafting recipe normally, but no, I can't access the word craft unless I do something with the buttons, right? Is there like a keystroke I can go in to get the crafting menu? I'm assuming I could go over here and do it, right? No, that's the pattern. Nope, that doesn't take it out. So how do I tell it to make something um, without removing it from the grid here? Does that make any sense what I'm trying to say? Like I'm trying to click on it. It just grabs all of that. See, now I can see the crafting. I got 12. I want to craft, uh, you know, what? Uh, 64. 12 from 64 is what? 52? I want 52. Start. See, it says I'm missing. I have 33 available. So let's do uh, 32 of it, right? Let's do that. So I don't want to use up all the pearls. And it has enough. I say start. There we go. So it's going to try to do that. And it should have loaded this up with a lot of stuff. And it did. So it's it's working. Maybe because the ender pearls and the way they stack, it doesn't know how to do it correctly. Maybe that's part of the problem. I don't know. Let's see if we can get some more ender pearls. Because why not? I should try to get some sort of staircase or something here. But, uh... Huh. for that for those okay well give me that there we go wow i need to get a lot don't throw it at him there we go i need to get a lot more of the emeralds i wish there was a better way to get emeralds but that's what we have and then if i go down here there are five i can only get two there we can get it from nether warts too we had it but that's kind of expensive the gold is the best way, but you got to get them to refresh. Uh-oh, uh-oh, it's getting dark. No. I must get back to sleep. Here we go. Time to sleep. Yeah. Hmm. More coffee. Right. Right. There we are. So, have you refreshed? No. And that's what I'm worried about, is getting these guys to actually refresh so that we can get more emeralds. Um... I wonder if we have to spend emeralds to get more redstone and then, or more of the, the stuff to get to kick over to get us to more of these. I don't want to spend all of that. That's, I mean, that's all we have for emeralds, I think. Yeah, that's all we have. But you know what would be really good and be really cool? Let's do something. I have an idea here. Let's see. Let's make another crafting terminal. Actually, I just need a terminal. I don't even need to have the crafting grid. I see a terminal. It's a, uh, this. Just a grid. I'm not going to make things. I just need a grid. Let's make a grid. But, well, I could make it a crafting terminal, I guess. It's not too hard to do, right? Because that makes the grid. There we go. And I, I make it a crafting grid. Nice. And let's get some more cabling. We need that, but we need a bunch more of that. And we'll just say, hey, give me more of this. That should be plenty. Okay. So, <clears throat> I think it'd be really nice if right here, right here, we had a, a, a terminal. Like, right there. And that way we can just access it, you know? That'd be kind of cool. But how do we get into there? So we got to get on. It's three blocks over from this. One, two, three. And a couple blocks down. We should see eventually here without releasing the guy. There it is. Okay, so that's what we want to see. And we got to hook this cable into here. And now we got to run this cable that way. Um, actually, I want to run it one block back further so we don't 
like mess up what they look like. There we go. Oh, I just took out a torch. You like that? Torch remover. Thomas will not like that. Okay. And now we can get out of this hole. Fill it in so nobody can get into here. And, uh... Let's go back and let's hook this up to our storage line and we'll be good. Okay, so there's where it is. And we have a line over this way. Yeah, this will work. Let's hook it up to the grid. And it's hooked up over here. And there's where we're gonna turn the corner underneath here I'm hearing dudes out there using their their uh, potions does that mean that they've reset is that what that means like they reset their their trades I don't know but that's kind of cool sounding but there we have our grid so now I can just stand here and I can do our trades I can say what do you have for me and it did it means they've reset their trades which is awesome We'll get some there. And we'll... I love that sound. That's a great sound. Are you still have more? Yo, you can do more. Awesome. So we got to listen to that sound. That's good. And we're getting some emeralds now. So this is a way for us to uh, get some resources here. And what do you want? Four for emerald pearls. And five for emerald pearls. Emerald pearls. Okay. You got some more trades for emeralds. Or so emerald pearls. Did I say emerald pearls? Ender pearls. <laughs> Good golly. Okay, let's get some more of these. Uh huh. Should reset them. And we can actually get some here now. I'm not so concerned because I know we can get them. Okay. And that hasn't reset. But look at this. We just go, okay, it's in our storage system. We have 44. We need 20 more. I can do that, and I say craft, and we'll just say 20. And from down here, outside, we're missing two. Really? Okay, so we need what? We can do 16. Start. Start. And upstairs, it is currently making what we want. Just like that. So we are doing really, really well here, I think. Let's see if we can get this last little set, because that was the goal, is to get 64 Enderium. We can't get any more of the... Uh, gold trade. We're going to run out of gold pretty quick, but that's okay. We've got plenty of gold. Are you making me potions? Mm -hmm. uh. Did I put all my emeralds away? I did. Uh, You there. Give me some more redstone dust. And we got a level. That's awesome. Uh, it looks like we might have to wait for another day to go by. Which is going to happen not in a while. But we do have a bunch of resources we need to get moved over here. So let's go and uh let's go and do that and see if they come back while we do grab some stuff, okay? I'll put that back. Do you have any resources for trade? Uh yeah, you can trade some gold now. Okay. That's what I wanted to see. Wow, we're running out of gold pretty quick. Grab that, I want that, and there we go. Okay, and you do the same thing. And do you have it for four? You have it for four. There's six more. Throw all of that into the system. And now if we look at endearing, we have 60. If I take that out, we craft it. We say we want to have four. Start. It has it. It's ready to go. It takes four pearls, one platinum, three of that. There we go. I'll put that back. And that should get us to 64 in just a second. And that was the goal here. So we can now make some endearing. This is excellent. I'm very happy. Now, my plan is to go and grab all the resources from where the digital miner is and bring it over and get those ores processed so we have them in the storage system. I also want to uh, get ready to go and see if we can make some of these other solar pieces, okay? Because I haven't really done the signalum wet yet to make. I've done this, but I haven't made solar panels. And we're trying to make these pieces. Like, we're going to have to make this. We have lithium dust. We have osmium crystals. We don't have lumium or the spirited crystal. So there's three more pieces we need 
and we have the DT fuel and we have platinum. We just need the nitro crystals. So there's only like four big components and then it's just a matter of crafting everything up. So we are, guys, we're getting very close, um, I think. So probably in the next like maybe 10 episodes or so, maybe we'll get this done. Anyway, guys, that's all I've got time for today. If you like this video, please click that like button. If you have any comments, put them down in the comment section. And if you'd like to be notified of the videos that I produce, please subscribe to this channel and don't forget to hit the little bell icon so you get all the notifications, okay? Thanks, guys. Have a great day. Bye-bye.